So just a quick message before this video and this playthrough begins. Um, I've already recorded 20 episodes of this and I had previously uploaded it to the Purple Umbrella. I've decided to take it off of there and repost it on Deck of Cards. So just a heads up, please ignore any sort of mention of the Purple Umbrella or any sort of mention of my second channel or any talk like that. Um, it's all going to be on Deck of Cards from now. I hope you guys enjoy it. Like I said, 20 episodes, and then I'm going to start recording new stuff, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Please do leave a thumbs up, and if you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe. And if you want to keep up to date, press the little bell. I'm going to be uploading these as quickly as possible, as frequently as possible. Thank you for listening, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoy it. Welcome to Skyrim. Ho ho ho, we're here, and I've turned into Santa Claus. What a way to kick off this episode of The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Holy shit. Oh, I've been given a thing. Okay, I didn't even have my controller in my hand, but we're just going to go ahead and not play on that. <laughs> we're going to play on Adept, and I might up it. There we go. Let's just pretend that that never popped up. So... Skyrim is a game that I love dearly, however, uh, I haven't really been able to play it recently. I feel like I've been very, very burnt out on just the Elder Scrolls in general. Um, I've been on like a massive, massive Fallout binge. I've just been on a big Bethesda binge. A big hey, Bethesda you, binge, the big triple B. What up? You were trying to cross the border, right? Yes, I was. Right I'm not Imperial going to listen Empire. to you because everybody has seen this intro and before, so I'm just going to talk over you. Um, but anywho, this has been planned since late October. Red Dead Redemption 2 screwed with that planning, um, which if you look through the channel, you can see that Red Dead Redemption 2 took over everything. Um, was it the first series on the channel? I can't even remember. No idea. No, Dishonored. Dishonored had been around for years. Hello. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric, the Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the rebellion. Yeah, the big cheese. You. The big cheese. Oh, God. oh is that, um, Hadvar? I think it is. Hello, Hadvar. I never noticed you before. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? Somewhere without a bath, apparently. The Lord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. So yeah, I know a lot about Skyrim. Um, like, probably more than a lot of people do, because I listen to, like, a lot of videos in the background while I'm playing other shit, and they just tell me, like, weird ungodly knowledge that just slips into my subconscious, and I'm like, oh, I know this about Skyrim now. So, we might come across things that I might, like, kayfabe, pretend I don't know, or I might legitimately not know, and hopefully you won't know the difference. <laughs> So if I come across something, I'm like, haha, I don't know who you are, Raloff. Then, yeah, I might be lying. I might not be lying. Nobody knows. But I'm really, really excited to play through this game. Funny. I'm ready. I'm ready, Raloff. I don't know what I look like. We can't see my legs. I've got no legs. Hello. He's staring at the fact that I've got no legs. I'm, I'm a paraplegic. Is it a paraplegic, paralytic, paralytic, paraplytic? I've got no legs. Oh. All right, all right. Hadva. Hadva. Oh God, his horse has just rotated. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting. All right, you've got a massive dent in your cheek. No, wait, I don't know how I feel about that. Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got yeah, to tell thief. them we worked with you. This is a mistake. Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time. Empire loves their damn lists. All right. Ulfric Stormcloak, Yarl of Windhelm. 
I want to pre-warn you, I'm not prepared for what race I'm going to play as. I have no idea. I'm probably going to go with Old Faithful, who you will see very, very soon. I've just decided it in my head while I was talking. I was like, oh, I'm going to go with that race. No, I'm not a rebel. You can't do this. Halt! Halt! Shoot! Fire! Oh, stretching back at ankle. Bloody hell. I was watching Hostel once, I'd clicked onto it, because it's like one of those, I'm a bit of an extreme person, I'll, oh, who are you? I don't know, nobody knows, uh, I'm a bit of an extreme person, I like things that are a little bit sickly, I like sore and stuff, and uh, no, I couldn't do Hostel, Hostel was just a little bit too much, um, <laughs> not my type of thing, so we're going to go with, I'm going to be a necromancer, or like a conjurer, which is why I've chosen Breton. And the reason I'm doing this is because I've tried to do a play for a Skyrim before and I've tried to go against what I'm good at and it's not worked. I just don't play it for that long. And it's kind of like when you play any game and you, you have like your set way of playing it and you know what you're good at and whatever. And I like Conjuration. I'm massively into Conjuration and Destruction Magic and that sort of stuff. So that's what we're going to go with. Um, do I want some gnarly face paint? No, it's not gnarly at all. Oh, hello. No, we're not having any face paint. It should be a normal person. But I was watching Hostel once, and he cut the back of the dude's foot. And, like, I don't do tendons. That's the only thing I don't do, and you could see that, and I'm not a fan. But, yeah, that was, like, a fun little... <laughs> a fun, not... So... Oh, God. Fun, not so fun little anecdote about me watching Hostel. I think we'll just stick with that nose. I don't know if that's the nose that we had before. Is it... I don't know. We'll put it there. Bloody hell. Mr. Copperspoon has seen better days. Especially in the land of uh, the Mojave. Um, let's just go... Oh, what have I just changed? Oh, his cheekbone width. I don't care about that. Eye shape. What eyes does he want? Um, um, very wide eyes. Um, I don't know. I guess just normal... Just normal default eyes. Which ones did he have? Were they... They weren't those, no? Maybe it was those. I don't know. I shouldn't have changed it. I should have just left it alone because I don't care about what his face looks like. <laughs> I'm not going to be looking at his face at all, but it's fine. Oh, he looks quite happy. I mean, his mouth looks a little bit like a cat's arsehole, but he looks quite happy. Um, give him some black lipstick, like Gerard Way. G Gerard Way? <laughs> Trying to be, trying to be hip and down with the kids, <laughs> Gerard Way. <laughs> Brilliant. Um, I don't know what hair I want to give him. Uh, something like longish, I guess. Like maybe that. What is is that? Kwai Guan Jin. It is. We don't want Kwai Guan Jin hair. Um. <laughs> Maybe just that. I don't know. I really don't. That's Quagwon Jin hair as well. Fucking Quagwon everywhere. Right, we're just going to go with that hair. And then we want a nice big beard. A nice big beard. That No, oh, that's quite a decent beard. He's got, like, orange eyes. Ooh, look at them. Look deep into his eyes. Ooh, he's a little bit cross-eyed. Um, That's all I want to do. Is that it? Oh. Oh, done. There we go. Name your character. My character is going to be Oliver Copperspoon. That's right. We're crossing the realms. The realms? We're cro yeah, we're crossing the, the lines. The universal lines. And my new Vegas character is coming into here. Except for me, he's going to have his name spelt right this time. Are you from Daggerfall, Breton? Maybe. Fleeing from some court intrigue? Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. Wow. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. I never I'm liked sure red guards anyway. The high rock. If you are, are a red guard. Prisoner. You could be a red guard. Hadva, please. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero. He's got lovely hero legs. doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. I never noticed he had his legs out before. That's very brave. You started this war. 
plunged Skyrim into chaos. And now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. He's a light Caesar. Caesar's legion. What was that? Makes Nothing. things very, very difficult when you come to uh, picking what side you're on. You're literally picking between, like, Donald Trump and Adolf Hitler. It's not great. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over. Out of those two, though, I feel like Donald Trump could probably be persuaded. Adolf Hitler, however, he should remain gagged. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials, and you say the same. Oop. Lovely. Oh, his head's having a little bit of a dance in the box there. Hadvar looks very, very unimpressed with that head in that box. As fearless in death as he was in life. Oi, oi. No, no. Not today. That's my cousin, that is. Coming to tell you off. I said next oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'm recording this at a weird time because I've only just finished Dishonored. And I did make the claim that I was going to just do Fallout New Vegas daily. And I was like, well, I don't really want to do it daily because it's a bit too much Fallout New Vegas for me. <laughs> oh god, so I've just decided to start this insanely long game instead. How do they not see it easier? Oh, God. I wonder what a dragon's breath smells like. I bet it's not nice. Fucking hell, can you imagine being Fus Rodard? He just stinks like onions. Okay. No, I'm going. I'm not waiting for you. You're on Team Hitler. We're off. <laughs> ah! Oh, bye, Raloff. See you in a bit, mate. Oof, fucking hell. Almost didn't make that one. I was jumping the wrong way. I had to adjust midair. Look, child, come back. Look out, careful. Fucking hell, I'd buy almost burnt your sandals off, mate. Still alive, prisoner? Keep close to me if you want to stay that way. What? Gunner, Why? Take care of the boy. I have to find General Tolias and join the defense. God's guide you, Hadvar. I'm pretty certain we can find Tolias when we get out of the cave. Or maybe it's Ulfric that we can find. Stay close to the wall! I'm coming, I'm coming. Fucking hell. Ooh, ah. Oh! Pardon me, madam. Quickly, follow me! Hello. Go on, go, 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 go. Oh, you're jerking up the stairs, you alright? Oh god, I can hear stuff happening. Oh, I want her hood. Hello, can I have your hood? Oh! I thought I died. My hands have come apart. Oh, now they're back together conveniently. Hello. Maybe I've lost all circulation in them. Sure. Oh! Ow! <laughs> Oh, Hanvar! Move out the way! I'm going in here! Holy like Moses. Was that really well, holy Kinner, if I guess. Bring us of the end times. We should Mom. keep moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you oh, go. my hands. Take a look around. There should be oh. plenty of gear to choose from. Okay. see if I can find something for these bones. We'll search this chest. Give me this hat. I'm probably not going to wear the hat. I don't know if I'm tempted to play in third person or not. I might give it a go. Just for the sake of mixing things up. Because I don't really play in third person, ever. Uh, yes, we want to conjure familiar. That can be favorited and that. Brilliant. We will take this spare sword. This is why I'm not going to play in third person. Is <laughs> because it takes me forever to grab stuff. Is there anything we can pick up? Let's take this wine. Because it feels like I'm playing Fallout, but with swords. Uh, 
we're taking that book. I like books. We're taking books. Book, 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 book. I've got a master bookend. Let's go. Let's roll. Oh, Hadvar. Here we go. Hadvar, move out the way. Go, Riley, go. Go, Riley, go, Riley, go. Oh, fucking bullshit. Be careful where you're swinging, mate. Cry, kill. Oh, it's like the ghost of Rex. Even though we, man uh, we managed to resurrect Rex. Um, fair gold looks, that's what we want. Ah, what are you doing, man? Get off me. Oh, bloody charging at me like that. What the hell? Ah, oh, poor Gunja. Gunja? Gunja? Isn't Gunja. No, Raloff. Never mind. Hadval, let's go. Stop, stop him. I'm scratching my head. We're getting out of here. Go, 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 go! <laughs> we just leap in, conjure a dog, and leap back out. Which is probably going to be the summary for this entire playthrough. Come here, you git. Maybe I will up the difficulty, because this does feel slightly too easy at the moment, anyway. Oh my god! Fucking hell. Nope, don't want anything off of you, I'm afraid. What about you? Nope. No, thank you. I'm going to take this potion. This potion. Salt pile, yes. We want all of the alchemies. All of that shit, whatever it was. Uh, a large sack. I do not want any flour, thank you. Or potatoes. Or more sacks. I have enough sacks of my own. Let's up the difficulty, what we got. We're on Adept. Shall we go back up to Master? It was on Master to begin with, so evidently I was doing Summit right before. We'll go back up to Master and we'll see what happens. <laughs> we might have, end up having to take up Archery and just like using that sneak exploit, but it'll be fine. I'm hoping this Torturer dies so I can have his hood. Unless we accidentally kill him at this game. Ooh, slicing and dicing. Hey up, let me have a hit. Fucking hell, lads. Calm down. Oh, I hate it. I'm taking this book. Let's have a look at this knapsack. Do 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 Taking that man's skull. Right then. We're going to unlock all of these because it gets your lockpick skill up quite early on, which is nice. Boom. And it's easy as piss. I don't think there's out in there though, apart from that skull. We also want to get the mage clothes out of this one. Oh. There we go. Spark, just please. There we go. Uh, what we got? Novice Hood increases your magicka by 30. Equip. And regenerates 50% faster. I will disenchant that. Because I tend to collect enchanted things because you can get a lot of XP really, really early on in the game by disenchanting at Farangar's enchantment table. Hello! God, I hate you with a passion. I wish you'd hold still so I can look at your wrinkly, wrinkly testicle face. Ugh. See what's behind here. I think there's some books behind here. Aha, there's a book. Brief history of the Empire. Blah 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 blah. You can look all, look at that on the wiki. There's a lot. Fucking hell. Let's get out of here. No wonder it's taken them so long to make the next one. Let us roll, Hadva. Me and Rexy boy, who will soon get replaced by Satan because I've watched Sips play Skyrim. And now, my flame Atronach is just always known as Satan. Uh, ch -ch -ch. Come on, Adbar, what are you stopping for? Just keep going, man. This is why I don't like AIs in video games. Unless it's Halo. Where Love AI in Halo for some reason. Go? Always gotta let what the Marines survive. Go, 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 go. 
Oh, God, not that way. Why has he gone that way? Ah! Help! Oh! I'm far! Help me! Oh, fucking hell. He's just backhanded her with his shield. Come on, join in, lads. Oh, she's looking at me. Victory for you. Victory! No, 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 no. Oh, God. There we go, there we go, there we go. Chop him down, chop him down. Chop him down. Here we go. Boom. Oh, I've just been shot. Uh, God, none of them have got the arrows on. It'll be these ones that have got the arrows. The arrows. Go, 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 Rexy. Oh. Fucking bullshit. Oh, there we go. Whoa! Like Superman stabbed him. There we go. That's what I wanted. A long bow. A long bow. Alright. See you later. So I have got an ulterior motive behind doing this playthrough. And that's because I only need 30 more achievements on Skyrim Remastered. And I really want them. <laughs> and there's a lot of guilds and stuff that I just haven't decided to do since buying Skyrim Remastered. I got Skyrim Remastered like the day that it came out. I think it was September in 2017. Like early September maybe. I can't quite remember. Um, remember, remember. A date in September. Which I will not. Uh, but I've not really played it that much since then. Not as much as I played it on Xbox 360 anyway. Which I'm hoping to now change. So this is kind of like an achievement hunter sort of playthrough I guess. We're going to be doing a lot of guild stuff and just doing a lot of vanilla things in the game. And maybe when we get to the end of it, I'll go ahead and start experimenting with mods. Might end up doing a second playthrough with mods. I don't know. I don't know. I simply do not know. But I'm not going anywhere near these fucking spiders. Not in a million years. It's the one thing I do not toy with on this game. Come on. There they are. Hadva. Look at that damage. Oh my god. That one's sponging. That one's sponging. There we go. Oh! Oh, that was terrifying. Not a fan of that. Let's take the frostbite ven uh, venom though. Because we can sell that. I like getting a lot of cash very, very early on. Um, luckily, I don't need the 100,000 gold achievement. I ended up doing like an entire playthrough just for that one achievement. Because it's one of the difficult ones. Um, and yeah. <laughs> As soon as I got it, I was like, oh, well, there's not really much else for me to do on this playthrough now. Because I'd done it very, very strange. Where I'd, like, been levelling up speech and stuff. Boom! Hello, Mr. Bear. Uh, Mr. Bear? Hello? Oh, God, I thought he'd entered an animation with it, because it jolted slightly. Oh, that was very uncomfortable. Not the sneaking type. No, I'm not the sneaking type. We are almost out of this bloody cave. A broadsword in one hand and a magic spell in the other. I'm the last of the dragonborn. There's no other, my brother's a